Hey everyone, I'm Lee. I had this job once where I worked as a breakfast chef for a remote mine site and it was my job to feed 28 hungry men every morning for breakfast. I started offering them this omelette as an alternative to bacon and eggs and in the end I was making so many omelettes. At the mine site they had this awesome flat hot plate which I was able to do the omelettes French rolled style but at home I use a non-stick pan that works great. This is how I did it. It's simple, it's delicious and it only requires a few ingredients. Onions, red pepper and mushrooms are such a wonderful combination and this is the filling for my omelette. So I chop up some onion, some red capsicum and some mushrooms into a smallish dice. About the same quantity of each. This amount makes three three egg omelettes. Next I take a bowl and I crack three whole eggs into it and I sprinkle in some salt and some cracked black pepper. Then I add a couple of tablespoons of cream and I whisk it all together with a fork until it's thoroughly combined and then it's time to cook. I like using a non-stick pan at home. So I warm a pan up over a moderate heat and I add a pat of butter and when the butter starts to foam, I add the vegetables. I sprinkle them with a little salt and cracked pepper and cook them over a moderate heat, shaking the pan and stirring until the vegetables have softened slightly and this takes about five minutes. Once done, I remove them and wipe out my pan. I turn my heat down to low and then I add a knob of butter to the pan and wait until the butter is foaming and then I pour the egg mixture into the pan. I let it cook gently for a minute or so and then I swirl the mixture around coating the sides of the pan and then gently push the sides down with a spatula. I repeat this process a couple of times until there is no egg mixture left and the top is starting to set. Then I sprinkle some grated cheese over the top and I let it cook for a minute or so. At this stage, when I touch the omelette, it feels almost set. I put some of the vegetable mixture on one half of the omelette and then I let it cook for a little while until the omelette is firm enough to flip and then using two spatulas, I flip one half over the other and cook it only for another minute or so. Don't worry if the flip doesn't work the first time. Sometimes it takes a couple of omelettes to get it right, but even if it doesn't look so pretty, it still tastes delicious. I slide the omelette on the plate and I sprinkle over some fresh chopped parsley and I taste it, tastes so good, and I sprinkle over a little more salt over the top. It is soft, yummy and full of flavour. The key is not to overcook it and to cook your omelette on a low heat. Thank you chickens for your amazing eggs and thank you guys for watching. See you again soon.